At last. You took your time coming to meet me, monkey. How disappointing. This clearly isn't Erimeris, the Cabal's Archon, whom we had the displeasure of meeting on Verbos 6. Once again, we are dealing with a pawn instead of the true root of the problem. <laughs> the little monkey remembered the Archon's name. Such a clever thing you are. You might just make a good pet after you've been properly trained and stripped of your misplaced arrogance. One of my soft-bodied kin. What meager offering tempted you to lower yourself to attending these animals? Or does their company remind you of being among your lost brothers and sisters? What do you know about my brothers and sisters, Dark One? <laughs> Only that they wander blind and helpless, robbed of their home and hope. <laughs> oh, but why am I telling you this? Isn't it your duty to watch over your kin, outcast? Speaking your language is slightly less trying for my patience than being forced to listen to a monkey machine butchering our tongue. Besides, I want you to understand well what I'm about to tell you. How is it that out of all of your kind, you're the only one to discover our feasts in advance? Usually, you're all so slow and sluggish that my kin have always been enough time to leave the battlefield before aid arrives. But still, time and time again, your dogs have been there to stand in the Cabal's way. That thing is perceptive. Monkey. Are you trying to convince me that a monkey, even a well trained monkey pet, is capable of perceiving the designs of the Drukhari? <laughs> Both you and your friend will pay for this audacity. I take it thanks will not be forthcoming. I will tell you this, monkey. I know you might be lying to me, or you might even be unaware of who is guiding your hand in any case. I have grown quite tired of your attempts to delay the inevitable. Surely you too have run yourself ragged chasing us between the stars. Let us put an end to this. Finish this standoff. My forces against yours once and for all. You wander among the stars, so you must know of this place. An ancient reach where the echo of stellar agony rings still. A place that serves as a graveyard for old stars, still filled with residual emissions and glittering dust. The place that buried your wreck, stuffed full of delicious, frightened monkey and the horrors that devoured them. The threshold of our domain. Your kind call it the Cinerus Maleficum. That is where our disputes will be settled. The Cabal of the Reaving Tempest will be waiting for you, monkey. Do not come unarmed. <laughs> <laughs>